John Gavin just came in from Rome, and he's been up for about 26 straight hours. So, John, we'll try not to shoot you any left-handed questions. Because my eyes are bleeding. So. <laughs> John, first of all, tell us about your role in The Mad Woman of Shio. Well, I have a delightful role, I think. It's the role of a, a hypocritical, money-making, a financial genius who uses uh, religion to make his money. A false man, a completely evil man. And it's a delightful role. Who do you play most of your scenes with? Well, most of my scenes are played with the other so-called conspirators. In our picture, it's uh, Yul Brynner and Charles Boyer and Donald Pleasance and Oscar Homolka and Paul Henry. And then I have a quite wonderful scene with uh, Miss Hepburn and the scene, uh, which is an exhortation to the crowds, myself. And uh, I had a scene at the beginning setting up my staff and where I was being massaged and some other things, but uh, in the interest of making the film shorter, that is no longer there, along with many other people's first scenes. What was it like working with Miss Hep Hepburn? I presume this was your first time to work with her. She'll never make it. <laughs> <laughs> no, she's lovely. She is unique, special. She is a, a remarkable actress and a remarkable woman. I am very keen on her, as you can see. And I was honored. I don't want to sound like I'm gushing, but I really was honored to work with her. It's amazing to all of us that all of these stars, big names, could be gathered together for this one film. Uh, over how long a period of time was the film in production? Do you know, John? In actual production? We started shooting in February of uh, last year, and uh, the fil film wasn't finished until July. That's, uh, as a matter of fact, it went a couple of months over the original production schedule, I understand. But uh, as I understand it, it's also well worth it. We had, when we started, uh, as you probably know, John Houston was originally the director, but uh, we ended up with Brian Forbes, who is also a marvelous director, and I think uh, a delightful fellow to work with. What is it that has you in Rome now? Is it a picture, or do you live there? Oh, no, it's a film. I'm a Californian. I was born and live in Los Angeles. As much as an actor can live anywhere, you know, we live where the work is. It's a vagabond life. I'm making a film. I uh, just got off yesterday, or day before yesterday, and I return Sunday to finish it next week, if I live. <laughs> well, we hope you do, and uh, we hope we live long enough to see The Mad Woman of Shio. We've been talking with one of the stars, John Gavin.